welcome if you're new via here be sure to click the subscribe button and also click the bell icon so that you'll be notified about videos uploaded from this channel the topics that we'll be discussing today ten shot two killed in gun attack oral chase and killed rubber gets slapped in portland and more a man was arrested in connection with the seizure of a firearm and several rounds of ammunition by lawmen during a patrol at Cornwall Mountain in Westmoreland on Saturday, May 28. Reports from the Savalamar police are that about 9.15 p.m., a team of officers were on patrol in the area when they observed a group of men standing at a bar. On the approach of the police, one of the men ran. The police made inquiries and the man was seen removing an object from his waistband. He was accosted. The object retrieved and found to be be a Berita 9mm pistol with a magazine containing 11 rounds of ammunition. The identity of the suspect is being withheld pending further investigations. Detectives from the Criminal Investigation Branch in Portland are investigating the shooting death of a man by a light firearm holder during an alleged robbery in the community of Nonsuch yesterday morning. Shortly after 3 a.m., the unidentified man reportedly entered the home of a retiree held him up at gunpoint and proceed to rob him of cash, jewelry and a cellular phone, the police report. During the robbery, the homeowner, who is also a licensed firearm holder, managed to pull his gun and fired a single shot in the direction of the robber, the police said. The man was hit in the chest area. An alarm was raised and the intruder was reported the phone lying on his back with a weapon beside him. He was pronounced dead on the scene by a doctor. This has to be one of the best news I heard since today. I mean, then how oh, you saw Otara for Lefushpa you come from? Coming at the people in community and gone in at this man house just because your ears say him retire. I don't feel like said the man call up and him can't help himself. I want to know who feed you with information to make you know say, or for convince you say him live alone and him can't help himself so you can get you very easily. Who can the news come girl? It's just a pity you dead with all of that information in a you because that person probably won't step forward any at all. And the only other way me see, I feel you if you watch this man for a while. So is either somebody give you the information say this man live alone, and you probably can get a food off of him, or you there roadside and watch the man for a while and decide say you could try to go in him house because you never see nobody I come to him. But Uncle, me love how you stand up for yourself and I make him take disadvantage of you. I bet you didn't saw that one coming. Me can bet you never even think of it. Said this man would have probably wipe you off of the map. You never think about that. Right, I know you don't need nothing more than one body bag and them just dash you out of sea or them just give you a little shallow grief because you don't deserve nothing more, nothing less. What tired you down now? More often, no one will come to realization and say, I work people, work for them things. Then they just sit down and find it and just have it so. Phone just come and take with the people, them hard working money with them sweat and tile and save for have. On the need for go look at nine to five until on can boss up for have things. It look like so on the feel like the people them just got work for one week and can afford everything what them want in the world. In a work say you no. Know, Sometimes the people they make sacrifice on top of sacrifice and save for have what them want, you know. And it just hard for say on just come and want to get away in a blink of an eye and expect to so get away with it. Not knowing the sweat with them off a sweat feet and the cry with them off a cry, the sleepless nights. Me I talk about the night them or the people them have got them bed hungry because them I try to save the money for get what them want. Only no know that you know no just want to see it and take it away in a blink of an eye. And in a work so uno have to know say you have to start from somewhere. So if I even forget one little wholesale work, one little work on the roadside, buy one bag of bag juice and start sell one bag of sweetie, something. You have to start from somewhere. You can't just get up and have big, big ready eye and see people things I want. It's a all the day on the life. And expect say, you know to get away with it. No. You know not to always get away. I want to you know, buck up and more retired persons like this are evil people who are fit and strong who can knock you out and make you understand what time it is a time for no got fend for yourself leave people and them things alone and for your cronies out there you know 
wa watch a video ya you know or them family member wa hide them you know my uncle open to tell them say listen full time now full time now for the low people and look on one the police are yet to establish a motive for a Saturday morning shooting of nine people, one fatally on Dunmere Close, Kingston, 19. The dead man has been identified as Sanjay Cousins, a 32-year-old, a resident of Ambrook Lane in Kingston, 10, where he died after being shot in the head, chest and both arms. Three women, one of whom is 17 years old, are among the injured who have all been admitted at the hospital. The police say they are gathering more information and following more leads before establishing a motive. They say as further investigations are conducted, more info will be released. It is reported that about 12.20 p.m., the nine were among a group of people gambling at the premises when they were accosted by gunmen who opened fire. When the shooting ended, and the gunmen flee, it was discovered that nine were injured. They were rushed to the hospital where Cousins was pronounced dead. This one so unlike it have something for doing some farm a gang war, you know. And innocent people are getting hurt. So we could see what gonna happen now, no? We just are waiting for the police them come for give them updates. We're moving right along. A furniture maker is Westmoreland's latest murder victim, 45-year-old Oral Wright, was shot dead in his community in Negril on Sunday morning. Reports are that Wright was trailed by his attacker shortly after 4 a.m. They shot him multiple times before making their escape. According to the police, residents heard loud explosions and informed them. Upon their arrival, Wright was found lying in a pool of blood on the roadway with multiple upper body wounds. He was transported to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. A man who is a friend of the deceased and who did not want to be identified told our news team that Wright was an easygoing man. He shared that Wright also operated a nightclub in Negril. Him running business, I know him ears now and him a good youth, he said. Anytime we open our eyes to sunshine, we have to give God thanks, he added in disbelief. And just before we go, I could take a step go over the entertainment side of the world. Now, it has been reported that a stage show that King was performing in Ghana gunman shoot it up and yes there is a video circulating on social media where you can hear the artists are perform and yes see the people them are run up and down while they shot them a bus but fortunately we can say that the artist was not injured i'm a want to know if a salt skin salt or a fiend time because everything just a go left for you like what happened what been a happen May I wonder if I hear them hear the lyrics and feel nice and under them look rum and them look weed and decide to alright, you know, so we are about to shot. Because at the time, him did a sing, how oh, you know about gunman shift? So I know if I dot them ear and it get to them brain and then decide to alright, I could pull off a little stunt. Or what go on? Views and subscribers, I would love to hear what are your thoughts on all these stories down below in the comment section. We have made it to the end of our next video. Thank you guys for watching. Catch you guys next time. I'm out to stay blessed and stay safe.